welcome back to mommy monday hope you're having an amazing monday as you know we're continuing our conversations this month on mental health awareness so let's get into it how are you guys doing how are you feeling it's been a year and some change of this um pandemic right and some people are ready to put it behind us and some people are no we're not ready to put it behind us we're still trucking we're still going at it it's still not over right how are you guys doing with everything um in this day and age and everything that everybody has been going through with the pandemic recessions parenting mothering uh you know all the issues that are happening um in life how are you really coping it's really key when it comes to your mental health and to the mental health of those around you and to your friends to your family to your loved ones to really 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 check in and not just be like, hey how are you or yeah oh, okay good you're good okay good i'll talk to you later sometimes it rolls so casually out of the tip of our tongues oh, okay or we're talking to a stranger um you know and you're like oh hi how are you and then you just keep walking you don't even slow down to hear are they good are they bad are they breathing are they surviving do they need like an ear do we even care to hear what they have to say once we ask it so in this uh mommy monday i wanted to to challenge you to really ask people to ask the people in your circle to ask people um that you care about how are you really doing how are you really coping and wait for the answer i challenge you to not send gifts or memes or like all this stuff um to really take the time to know are they really okay or are they just saying they're okay or maybe they're not telling me that they're not okay because i assume they're okay oftentimes the the strongest people in our circle in our friend group don't ever get checked on so if you have a friend that you always go to and you're like oh that's my strong friend i can go through anything and i can call so and so and i know they're gonna pick up <laughs> such a millennial how many people do like answer their phone like this my kid answers her phone like this like hello okay Either way, I digress. <laughs> I digress. And so, you know, oftentimes the the strongest people in your life are the ones that don't get checked on. Nobody really stops to find out how are you doing. How can I, you know, be of service to you? How are you really coping with all the load that people uh, throw on you? Often in therapy, the people that I do therapy with come to me a professional a stranger because everybody in their circle assumes that they're okay and they have to vent and come to me which i absolutely love um and i'm passionate about helping others but it's like hey a little side note from a therapist that talks to strong people all day check up on your strong friends they are not okay they need an encouragement they need just a checkup more than just a meme or a gif or a text or assuming that just because they seem that they have it together that they do so i challenge you how are you doing have you spoken to somebody so on this morning monday i leave you with that it's always a pleasure chatting with you and starting this and like i said May, May is Mental Health Awareness Month. How are you doing? Are you checking in on others? And are they really doing okay? That's the most important. Sometimes you may not have access to a professional, but a listening ear, a compassionate ear, often is a million times better. Okay, so I'll talk to you guys later. And if this video is helpful to you, please share it to your friends to that may be going through stuff and i will see you next time on mommy monday bye